How's it going, everybody? It's me, it's your friends, Yakra Commentator. Welcome back to yet another episode of Splatoon 2's Hero Mode. Last time on Hero Mode, we took on level 23 and 24, earning ourselves the second scroll and the Sardiniums. This time, we're going to be taking on 25 and 26. So, what do you say? Enough introduction, we just dive in onto the level. Platform Madhouse. Please mind the gap. Let's go. Ooh, the Splatling. Okay, interesting choice. I do enjoy me the Splatling, and this is actually one of the hero weapons that I've thought about getting. Now, is it? Is this it? Is this? Yes, it is. Okay, so what you want to do is, right at the beginning of this area, yes, believe it or not, at the beginning of the stage, you want to make sure you're on one of these platforms right here. Do be very careful, though. Oh, crap! No! Well, that failed tremendously. But yeah, make sure you are on the, one of those rotating platforms. Be very careful, too, because the ticket is actually underneath us. Crap, crap, crap. Those um, Octo Troopers are coming after me, and I don't quite appreciate it. I'm going to do this. No! Man, this is going to be a lot just to get that ticket, isn't it? Is there, is there an easier way to do this? No, I have to use the platform. I have to use the rotating platform. All right, cool. Well... If I get a game over, I swear, right as the video freaking starts, that's going to be hilarious. Thank the Lord Jesus Christ. Okay, there's a ride rail right there, thank goodness, with a ticket, or a crate that contains the ticket. Now get me the hell out of here. I was so paranoid that I was actually going to get a game over on this part right here. Right as the video started, the very first level, what is this? Oh, God. random crate that's in the middle of nowhere? Not really in the middle of nowhere, but... Oh, my God. I don't remember having that much trouble last time. Oh, whoa, you guys just kind of came up out of nowhere. How are you doing, you bunch of big old... Are you... What? You and your stupid shield. I don't even need to kill you, but I'm going to kill you anyway because you're annoying little shit. Okay, um, I probably shouldn't be as explicit. I do have kid children watching my channel. Try to behave, Tage. Okay, another... That... Okay, I can see why that's took Oh, God. We got ourselves a friggin' Octo Commander. I'm gonna get rid of you first, because you're the closest. Oh crap, no, 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 no. Ooh! Man, some that, these guys can be insanely stressful sometimes. I can see why that wears them out, because holy crap, having to fire that many, or having to fire off that. You know what, just, just forget what I'm trying to say. <laughs> okay, I think I might know... Okay, I kind of have a feel for where the Sardinium and the Sunken Scroll might be, so... I'm gonna throw my rain right here. Get rid of you. Okay, be very careful at, on this section, too, because if these guys hit you while you're trying to jump, they, as you guys have seen in many videos now, they will actually cause you to fall. Your jump will cancel out! Like that. Like that. Dude, that's so annoying when that happens, too. My god, the moment I freaking say it is the moment it freaking happens. I'm down. Okay, no, I'm not down to my last life. I got two more. Thank the Lord Jesus. Can you imagine if I actually were to die on this level? Okay, get out of here, you ugly little thing. Man, you guys may look really cool in Splatoon 3, but you're still just as ugly in Splatoon 3. I'm super excited for Splatoon 3. Oh man, that hero mode in Splatoon 3 looks amazing. Man, expect to see some hero mode on Splatoon 3 whenever it releases. Not right away. I probably will be, it probably will be like a few months before I actually do Splatoon 3 hero mode once after 3 comes out. Because I do want to play some Turf War, and I do want to get a feel for a rank battle too, and obviously I do have to play through hero mode myself first before I actually start doing a series on it. Because I do want to know where everything is. But I feel like it might take a while before... There's a wiki on it on where all the sunken... I'm assuming there's going to be sunken scrolls. I wonder if they're going to bring back the ticket mechanic. And then the sardiniums, too. Okay, be very careful, because once this door opens, they are waiting for you! Okay, be very careful. Didn't even kill them. Okay, I want to get rid of that Aqua Commander before he starts firing again. Well, I... I'm screwed. No, 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 I've already died twice. No, I've already died like three or four times on this level. I refuse to die again. Not on this level. I mean, this level can be a bit tricky, but it's not that difficult. Launch pad? Oh, yeah, that's a launch pad right here. Okay, so I believe in this general area right here with these really bizarre moving platforms is where the Sardinium might be. Okay, it's not over here. We have to get... Oh, oh, I think I see it. 
I'm pretty sure I see it. Yeah, those that giant moving wall right there, I see it. I'm actually gonna go this way, because those don't actually go. And you can die for all I care. Man, I sound really mean! <laughs> what? Dude, did you see that stupid aqua? <laughs> Thank you for that. Thank you. That was hilarious. You <laughs> just killed yourself. Oh my god. I can't wait to see that back in editing, too. That's gonna be so funny. Yeah, this video is already off to a freaking rockin' start, too. I'm off to a freaking hilarious start. Oh, this is gonna be a good. I was really. What the hell just happened there? Okay. Yeah, you start moving as I'm about to freaking. Oh crap. Oh god. Oh Jesus. No! I hate moving platforms! Hate them so much! Okay, get up there quick! Okay. It's down. Hey, I see you. Oh, big and beautiful. I couldn't even find the words to say right there, so I just said big and beautiful. I know it makes absolutely no sense, but you know what? Nothing I say makes sense. Oh, crud. Well, this is gonna be fun. I don't like this part right here. This part could be insanely stupid. This part right here sucks when you're trying to use a different weapon other than the stupid splat lane. It really does. I'm trying to hit this stupid thing over and over again. Okay, um... I'm running low on ink! Make sure you're fueled up on ink, page. Also, make sure you fuel it yourself. Start drinking some, um, drink your water after this. I'm thirsty. Okay, checkpoint! Okay, thank god. Oh! You idiot! You idiot! Okay, I need that plat. Come back! I need you! Come back here! Thank you! I will really appreciate you! Okay, get out of the enemy ink stage. Get out of the enemy ink. Now, here's the thing. There is a switch, as you guys can see right there. Obviously, because I'm playing a switch. No, I'm joking, not that kind of switch. But there is a switch on the platform with the zap fit. Oh yeah, that's right, this thing will start rotating. Okay, make sure you're full on E. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, you see that switch right there? We gotta hit set switch. And then a launch pad will appear, and we'll go over here to what Sheldon calls a deserted island. This is, is this some long forgotten deserted island that only inhabit is a freaking Octo. Uh, DX, wait a second. I don't wanna... I did not... Oh no, really? Really? Ah, oh, pay attention, you big dumb dummy. Holy crap, this level alone is taking eight minutes. <laughs> My god, age. What are you, some friggin' dummy? Yes, I am, actually. Okay, there it is, there it is, there it is. Okay, 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 okay. I can't believe that happened. I really can't believe it. I think it's the most I've died in a friggin' level, by the way. I'm having fun, though. At least it's hopefully making for some funny content for you guys. <laughs> oh my god, I'm such an idiot. I can't believe I was not paying attention and that Octo Stop DX just came up out of freaking nowhere. It was just like, yeet! Okay. And launch pad! Try to pay attention, Tage. I'm assuming that launch pad right there will actually get us on top of that thingy right there. Okay, let's find out. It does indeed, so I had nothing to worry about. Hey, we got ourselves a scroll. Now we can move along with the level and get ourselves a zap fishy. My dearest Callie and Marie, stop on a research trip to the Cape with Agent 3. Stop. Maybe late, but left dinner in fridge. Stop! Alright guys, I'm gonna do exactly what I did in the last episode. I'm going to uh, jump to this, super jump to this level. I'm gonna have a really quick cut, because I wanna get an idea on where to find the Sucker Scroll on the Sardidium. So give me a bit, and I'll be right back.
chip point five, so one four five. Okay, gotcha. All right, let's have dive on in. Paradise Lanes, get the ball rolling. Oh God. We got ourselves another bowling ball level. We got ourselves a freaking the hero roller. I was about to say the hero slosher. No, that's not even close. Now, this, there's a socket scroll and a sardinium, and they're actually, I believe, the ticket and a ticket, I should say. Obviously, there's a socket scroll and a sardinium. Every level has one, except for a boss level, if they only have a ticket. Why aren't you dead? Seriously, why aren't you dead? Now, after check shortly after checkpoint one is I'm out of ink. I am out of ink. Oh! That was scary. Man, what is it with me and my freaking screens today? Usually I'm not this... Not this paranoid, usually. I guess I'm trying to hype myself up for this recording session, even though I already am hyped up! Hi. Oh, oh no! Oh. Die, apparently. I totally meant to do that. Now, you see that crate right there? That actually holds either the ticket or the scroll. Or the sardinium. Obviously, one of the... Oh, it's the sardinium! We get the sardinium early on! Heck yeah! And there's a freaking ink storm right here. You are going to want this ink storm. Trust me. Take it, throw it, and if you can get that other ink storm, good for you. Be very careful on this platform, by the way, because of the bowling balls. Give me the storm. Give me the storm. I'm not talking about that one hero either. No, I think that's. I think Storm is a Marvel hero. Man, my god, if I'm totally wrong, so many people in the comments are going to be like, You're a friggin' dummy! Listen, I know. I'm not too big on DC or Marvel, okay? The only form of DC that I know is friggin' Injustice, and then Mortal Kombat vs. DC Universe! I totally did not know there were bowling balls right there! I can't. No. That. Die. Okay. I guess that's how we're going to start things off. Man, this... This video is just full of death after death after death. It's kind of funny, not gonna lie. Well, thank God I got the armor right there. Yeah, you, you know what? Since you're covered in ink, just die. Nobody cares about you. Nobody loves you. Your wife left you for a reason. That's so mean of me to say, but you know what? I don't care. I just want to get past this stupid bowling ball. Can you at least give me a strike? Phew, you made it. I know I did, and I liked it. Okay. I believe that crate right there. Maybe not that one in particular, but... I think the scroll... No, I think the scroll is... Okay, so you're gonna want... This. That way you can do this. And the Gushers still destroy the bowling balls, as per usual, right there. That crate right there holds our scroll, I believe. Oh my god, look at this. Did someone actually stack bowling balls to have them rolling like that? If so, someone please send me a video of that, because I would very much appreciate seeing that. That sounds... freaking awesome. Oh, crap. Um. Ah! Epic dodging skills. Thank you very much. Now we can just head on down here. Now we gotta go do the stupid gusher thing again. Boink! At least we know we can't get hit by a thingy. Okay. Um. You over there. Hey, how, I literally hit that. Ink hit. Oh god, that was scary. Can you imagine if that actually? If I actually took damage from that? Okay, so that was checkpoint four. Checkpoint 5 is over here, which means the ticket is somewhere over here, right? Is that it down there? It is indeed! Heck yeah, dude! Awesome! Now for this annoying part right here. We are close to the end, just so you guys are aware. We can tell because there's a giant freaking bowling ball thingy right there. You want to have a bomb? And this right here can actually push them off, but don't push them into yourself! Oh, oh my. Oh, Jesus. How you doing? How you doing, Jesus? Are you having a good day? I know it's not Sunday, but are you having a good day? talking to Jesus like yeah, she's actually gonna talk back to me. Jesus, if you're there, can I have money? <laughs> no, that sounds very greedy. That's very greedy, me, greedy of me, Jay. It's just very greedy. Just do your thing. Earn your money. Do your YouTube. Earn your subscribers. Earn everything. And just hit that freaking thing. Knock the stupid thing off. Be very... Oh, actually, I like this part right here. <laughs> the bowling ball destroyed both the idiots right there. All right, time to get ourselves a Zapfish. <laughs> All right, Calamari Research Labs video log number 5628. The coffin-like device is a historical relic of the old world and is kept under strict lock and key. I unplugged it by accident while cleaning the other day, but it seems to be still running somehow. Alright, that about does it for this episode. So, next time on Splatoon 2 Hero Mode, we're going to be taking on level 27 
And what do you say we do a turf war too? Because that's going to be a rather short episode if I just did this level in that video. So yes, we're going to be doing levels 27, getting the final sunken scroll, getting the second to last sardinium, and maybe a ticket here too, if there is a ticket. Well, we shall find out. And we're going to be taking on some turf war. So thank you guys for watching. Hope to see you back there. Hope each and every single one of you watched this video. It's a fantastic day. I'll catch all of you later. And don't forget, guys, you just got to stay fresh. Or no, don't get cooked, stay off the hook.